guys. It's me, Jared from Cashmere. Okay, so I just have some stuff that I've been commenting on like everybody's video to tell. And it's David Dotson. Him and Bex, he's a mortician. He has a pilot's license. He He's changed churches like six times in the last what year that's weird isn't that weird and and robin robin i feel robin has a drug problem i know i'm gonna get hate for that i don't care robin um in that one video i forget whose it is but she starts getting annoyed and you can see the real robin comes out because she's tired of talking about it she has her same story that she repeats over and over and over again where it's like freaking annoying she has her, not to be, I'm not rich, okay, but she has the same dresses that she wears like over and over and over again, like the same two dresses, okay? Um, she has that the red truck, sorry, a little odd. She, see, Dawn and Candace are too dumb to kill their daughter and hide her somewhere. I'm sorry, I don't mean to be rude, but she would have been found by now, okay? She would have been found by now. She's not, I mean, if they put her in a wall, that smells. If they, you know, got, like, they have searched everywhere. She's still alive. She, this is my thing, okay? Grand, Grandis and Candace went to get medication that day. Because they were going to give Summer some CBD. Those one CBD, like the, I don't know, the highest ones that you can get, right? So some candy. They called it candy. Candy from Grandma, right? Candy from Grandma. They give her that. She passes out, dude. Because when she's on the milk cartons, that kid is either dead or passed out. Okay? And she looked like she had get, been given a bath, that she was dressed warmly, you know. Um, do you notice how also these children, their hair is dyed like a pink and a purple, and then it's like shaved halfway, and then they do the full shave, and then they're missing. Do you notice? I'm just pointing that out. There are also at least 18 airports in and around Rogersville, right? That's not counting the private airports. There's one less than two miles away from the from 110 Ben Hill Road, okay? It is actually a last name of my best friend growing up. It's her mother's family's last name, and I've never heard this last name anywhere else, okay? But these planes are private jets. You can um, reserve it, you know, for whatever. They have 10 planes, okay? So, if you gave Summer some of this heavy dose of CBD or whatever, she's going to sleep, what, four, six hours? I mean, maybe even 10, 12, 12 like, because... Look, a child is not going to scream. They're not going to cry. They're not going to be hungry. They're not going to ask where they're going. They're not going to notice things on the way there. Okay? These weirdos planned this. They planned it. David Dotson didn't just join that church literally 10 days before she was missing for nothing. He's creepy. His shoes creep me out. Okay? I know I, I, everyone makes fun of me, but those freaking shoes, that little blue, little Velcro shit going on, what is that? I mean, what, you got to put them on fast? Like, what are you, like, I don't know. Like, why do you have Velcro shoes, dude, when you're like 60? I don't know how old you are, but you're old, okay? Why, when your wife is dying, do you move from where you've been your whole life to Tennessee, to a new church? And everything and then when she dies you just go to a new church and then now a new church and it's weird okay these K 
Candace and Dawn either sold her summer. Pet, there's a pedophile ring going on. And the police plucked her out. And this is a big brr because have you noticed that Dawn and Candace never get in trouble for anything. Ever. Ever. But then again, I feel Dawn and Candace aren't really involved because they have been they have been involved with the police and stuff so much that you wouldn't want to call the police unless something really bad was going on, right? Like, I mean, they hung out with weirdos, okay? Like, creepy people, all right? Like, this whole Allison thing, how she had that little girl and, like, went to New York. Okay, that's another thing. If you're poor, if you live in a, like, a freaking hut, okay, everyone's seeing their house. If you live in that, how are you going to all these places? How do you have these new, brand new fast cars that are worth more than your house? Hmm? Where did Grandis go? I know if my child, if my granddaughter was missing and my daughter needed me, I would freaking hightail it out of there. So... Are they hiding her? Was Dawn molesting her? What the hell, Candace? Man up, girl. You used to look like a tough lady, like the tough, like, manly lady that didn't take shit. Now all you do is cry, girlfriend. Seriously, now's the time when you need to get that mom mad and you need to find your freaking daughter. Okay? Okay? I also want to know, we know you guys have a drug problem major drug problem okay you can't even go on live without doing whatever you're doing now it looks to me like heroin okay um how did you guys go to dr phil and like when you have like a problem like that you probably need to like you can't just go on vacation without any drugs okay i'm just saying right now so how did you fly there with drugs, or did you get it when you were in California? So who do you know in California? I know I'm random. I know I'm going from one topic to the next. I hear that in the comments a lot. I'm sorry. But these are things everyone needs to think about. Also, Summer was already passed out when they put her in the car, okay? No kid is gonna get in the car and then pull their freaking hood over the side of the shoulder. All right, no, somebody used that hood and they held her up and they buckled her in and they used the little milk cartons to hold her up, okay? They, Summer was never awake when she got, I don't even know if Summer made it home, okay? I think they probably met somebody and they did the handoff. Okay. <laughs> Okay, this is another question I have. I'm sorry. But if you get, like, three of your children taken away before, or sorry, two, how do you have more kids and they let you, have, like, keep them? Because look what happens. <sighs> I'm just saying. And the whole Dawn on the watch list. Has anyone, has anyone brought that topic up? Anyways, all I'm saying is, seriously, I don't know if this is a just a big joke or if that she really, I mean, Ronnie lost and also Mr. Sheriff man that nobody ever, like, runs against. That the only way you got to be sheriff is because you busted your whole family. Um, you're a little sketch, too, and you creep me out, too. I'm sorry, but you do. Do and so how does how does that family reunion go when when everyone gets out of prison? Are you the guy they don't like, or how does that work? Or did you let them out early? Anyways, these are just questions I have. Anyways, okay, I gotta go. Please like and subscribe.
And I know I talk fast. I know I'm random. But I just have to say what comes to my mind first. So, I'll be back. In summer, we will find you. Just because your parents don't give a shit, which obviously they don't. If you did, Candace, you'd man up, stop crying, stop doing those drugs, and get your freaking kids back and find your daughter. Okay? A little pep talk. Anyways, hope everyone has a good night. Bye.